This is my cat Ralph defying gravity. And this is my other cat Bella assembling an army of clone Bellas. Together we're going to show you 13 incredible cat illusions, as well as revealing the secrets behind them. Let's start with those gravity illusions. Something weird happened when I tried to feed Ralph earlier. And when I tried to give Bella some cat milk? But I think the cats might have something to do with it. I set up some cameras to try and catch them in the act. And sure enough, I captured this. And if Ralph was ignoring gravity, Bella was full on mocking it. She then headbutted the lampshade before Ralph had a go at rolling around himself. So how exactly does this work? Thanks to some good old movie magic, an upside down set. Making this was so much fun. It's the small details like the frames and ornaments that really sell the illusion. Not to mention the working ceiling light I installed. I then tried the effect with Maisie, with me, and of course with the Lego train. The other one was done in a similar way, except this time suspended on its side, meaning there's now cat food all over the floor, which Bella selflessly volunteered to clean up. Talking of Bella, I've recently had an oil painting commissioned of her, and it is magnificent. The composition is stunning and the brushwork exquisite, almost like she could just climb out of the frame at any moment. So how did she do that? Well, it's a set, with a real hole cut into the background, but the shot at the start uses a real frame picture to trick you into believing the illusion. Ralph and Bella weren't having any of it, however, so it got me thinking. Let's see if we can trick them. This might look like an ordinary bowl of cat food, but it's actually something called an anamorphic illusion. An image distorted and printed so at the exact right angle, it looks like it's really there. But will Bella fall for it? Yes. Well, maybe. Well, probably not. When viewed from the side as Bella did, the illusion doesn't work. So it's likely she was just sniffing an interesting new object. Not to fear, let's try something else. This is an object called a mirror scope. And see this cat treat right here? Well, it's not really there. It's actually inside the dish. See how the illusion appears and disappears? But it uses curved mirrors on the inside to make it appear as though it's floating on top. But how will Ralph react? He was initially intrigued, but quickly lost interest, rolling around and demonstrating just how fluffy he's got for the winter before toddling off. Bella, however, was much more curious. But if I speed up the footage, she couldn't quite figure out how to get to it. I ended up helping her out, and look how absurd her reflection is. She still couldn't reach it because of her donut, so I had to help her again. That was still inconclusive. Bella could probably just smell the treat. So let's try one more illusion to try and fool her. You know how cats like sitting on things? Well, what if we make a thing that isn't a thing? If I cut out four three-quarter circles and lay them out like this, they form a square in negative space. But will either of the cats be tempted? Of course not. Cats don't do what you want them to do. It looks like they've outsmarted me again. The other day, I noticed a strange light coming from inside this vent. Call me crazy, but there is definitely something glowing in there. I took the cover off, but before I had a chance to look, Ralph came climbing out. And it only got weirder. What even is this place? Wait, how did that get in here? Bella? Oh no, it's not another evil lair, is it? What have I told you about your evil plans? Rather predictably, it's a set. The same one, in fact, repurposed now for the third time. There's a hole in the wall, and behind it, another set. And with hindsight, I'm not really sure this even constitutes an illusion. But I spent like a whole day building and filming it, so yeah. Now this next one is actually from an old video of mine, so I'll only cover it quickly. A lenticular mosaic. If I alternate columns of different coloured Lego slope pieces like this, from the right, it's all black, but from the left, entirely white. I can then use this same technique to essentially interlace two separate images, and it is seriously cool. From the front, it's complete nonsense. But from the left, it's Ralph. And from the right, Bella. You can also do the same thing without Lego, by printing out two combined pictures and folding along the lines. I'm really bad at folding. And again, you could argue this isn't even an illusion, but it's pretty cool nonetheless. Okay, this next one's really simple, but one of my favourites. This might look like it says Bella and Ralph, but it's just an illusion. Ooh. Sorry, I promise never to do that again. These next few are going to take on the form of hide and seek. Bella isn't currently visible, but she's hiding behind one of the objects in this room. Can you guess which one? That's right, she's behind the rug. It's another anamorphic illusion, a forced perspective trick that when viewed at a specific angle, makes a rug look flat and ordinary. But let's try another room. Ooh. 
Ready? Well, Ralph wasn't actually hiding because he doesn't fit. It's a doll's house. Bella then came along and well and truly destroyed it. <laughs> Bella. I guess she got a lot of practice in that Catzilla video a few years back. The final hide and seek is a bit different. I let Bella choose her own hiding place, but she's not very good at it. I could hear a loud muffled meowing coming from the box. But when I looked inside... Bella? Wait, no way. How does that work? I definitely wasn't imagining things. The box was bigger on the inside. How did you even get in there, Bella? So how does it work? You guessed it, it's a set. The box is really deep, but the floor is raised to give the illusion that the box is normal sized. And don't worry, Bella wasn't trapped in there, it's open at the bottom. And lastly, after a whole decade of research and testing, I finally finished my cloning machine. Which definitely isn't two compost bins I spray painted silver. Let's try it with a hundred dollar bill. Whoa! Okay, let's clone Bella. It worked! Now let's make a whole army of Bellas. You see, I have a lot of people to thank for donating to the Charity Water Fundraiser, and what better way than cloning a Bella for every donor? So I want to say an absolutely enormous thank you to Asahi, Elia Krivonosov, Andrew Lisa Thomas and Cats Molly and Jakey, Ian and Kira Wang, Ian Winnier, Isaac Shielson, Mary, Andrew and Cecily, The Schroders, Amanda O, oh, Ben and Dean Lambert, Jen and Elle, Martin Bray Perez, Myra and her cats Milo and Millie, Alex, Henry and Kira Kitty, Murphy Briggs, Elizabeth H, Everett Kajinski, Caden and Colton Towerack, Chris the Cyclist, Trent the Great, Keaton and Kenzie Marsh, Deacon Trojanowski, Farta Otter and Mama Lama, Peggy and Max, Robbie and Harry B, Max Pausty, Rose and Dylan, The Gillette Family, Madison, Sam, Duchess Flint and King Archibald the Seventh, The Stanley Webbs, Noah and Landon, Cora S from Minnesota, AJ, Sammy and Delilah, Eli and Hope the Cat, Geo Morgan, Kieran and Dad, Henry Nuttall, Max Stragnall, Lucas and Eleanor PC, Violet, Isabel, Lily and Nelly Blundell, Gregor and Darwin, Vivian Crookshank, Stanton, Layla Burmetz, Toby F, Seb and Vivi, Benji, Canyon, Jasper and Jojo, Keegan and Muffin, Kara and Cats, Martlet, John T. Ron, Warwick Debbage, The Cat Loving Lego Nerd, Harper, John and Kim, Cutler Clan, Caitlin, Tiny Cat and Stella, Yvonne, Myra Z, Oliver Schumann, Lucy, Ruben, Zinnia and Augie, Lilibet and Arto, Owen and Keegan in California, The Walpoff Family, Kai Bear and Henry Banana Works Barrett. That's a lot of generous people, and a lot of Bellas, but how did it work? I essentially take a blank background image, as well as four or five images with Bella in different locations, then digitally cut them out and overlay them on the original. It's probably cheating, but I can't argue with the Bella army. Seriously, someone please send help? Look how fluffy you are, buddy. Sorry you aren't in this video much.